Hello fish lovers and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to try to reactivate cuprisorb. I have been using cuprisorb to remove cupramine, which is uh, copper that I added in my tank to rid my fish of ick. The cuprisorb indeed changed color to a deep blue black or something like that. I'm going to show you uh, the cuprisorb color right away. So. This is the cuprisorb box for regeneration it says to soak in a non-metal container with two cups of water and half a cup of muriatic acid. Um, I do have water, I do have a non-metal container um, and muriatic acid, I have uh, car battery acid. So I'm going to try with that. I don't know it, if it's the same with muriatic acid, but it's the only acid that I, that I have. So, of course, I'm going to follow the instruction. Um, soak for one hour. Rinse well. Repeat as required to restore the original color. I'm going to do that. I'm going to put two cups of water, half a cup of acid. I'm going to pour them, pour the solution over the cupisol. And hopefully it will get the same original um, gold color that it was when I bought it right now this uh, container is empty but I still have some left in here but to check the original color of the cupisorb you can watch my video about cupisorb when I open this box and see the color okay now let's go ahead and prepare what I need to regenerate the cupisorb I'm going to be working with acid it's a very dangerous sunset. Uh, I must be careful not to drop the acid on my, my, my skin or on my clothes or anything like that. Yeah. It's best to do it outside, but now it's, um, it's in the winter time, it's cold outside, so I'm going to do it in my kitchen. Okay, let's go ahead and I'm going to take the cupis orb out of the water. So you can see the cuprisorb right here, it has been sitting in my tank for maybe 4 weeks. It still has some gold color in it, so there, this can absorb copper even more, but I do not think, I'm, I'm really pretty sure that I do not have any copper in my system. You can see it, you can see the color. It's blue. But it has some some gold in there, so I'm not going to take it out of this bag because I don't know how can I uh, I don't want to lose any of the of this uh, resin. You can actually see it on my hand. You see it? The bag is not doing such a great job retaining the cupisor, but it works. Water can pass through it. So now I'm going to put this in a non-metal container, two cups of water and then half a cup of uh, acid. I'm going to leave it for one hour and I'm going to mix it gently. Of course not with my hands, with, a, with something, with a plastic uh, spoon or something, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Or maybe should I, should I take it out? Um, I don't know, I, I, I don't want to take it out from this bag. You see that there's a lot of uh, for me here. It worked great for my tank. Okay, I'm going to get ready. I'm going to add one liter of water and half a liter of acid. I'm going to mix them together in this uh, small bucket. And I'm going to put the cupisorb in here and let it soak for one hour. The solution is turning a bit uh, milky, but anyway, you see the color. I'm just going to leave it here and mix it from time to time, okay? So, 
I'll check it after one hour. I took uh, out the cupressor out of the bag because I want to see the color more cre clearly. It does uh, has a different color, as you can see, more yellow. But uh, I think that uh, I will have to redo the process again because I am still. I believe I still see some uh, dark coloring here. But I'm not really sure. Anyway, I'm going to think about uh, redoing the process, but uh, I just want to show you guys how you can reactivate uh, Cupresorb with uh, an acid bath. So it's not uh, it's not that hard to do, but you really have to be careful with acid. Do not let it uh, get on your clothes and on your skin, and it's best to wear eye protection also anyway i think i'm going to just uh, dry this uh, copy sorb out <coughs> and i'm going to check the color again and and i'm going to re-watch the original video when i open the box brand new to see what was the color But I believe that uh, I can st still see some blue, some blue color in there. Yes, yes, I do see it. So I think I will redo the the process all over again. But anyway, enough with this video, guys. Thanks for watching and. If you like my videos, please consider subscribing. It's uh, you can really help me out. Until then, have a great day and see you later. Bye.